One, I want to congratulate members of county assembly. I predicted in December that we'll go back where we are today and during the first impeachment. I want to thank the MCS, Mr. Speaker. It is their constitutional right. Impeachment is a political process. Mr. Speaker, I'm happy gender is not on trial. It is about the competency, the ability, and discharge of the work of the governor. Mr. Speaker, when you look at the loss of 78 million, Mr. Speaker, the county assembly has gone beyond and proved that the governor could not account for 78 million. Mr. Speaker, that charge has been proved. Number two, Mr. Speaker, on the appointment, I was shocked, Mr. Speaker, under Article 183, Article 65, Article Section 30 and Section 45 of the County Government Act, Mr. Speaker, you have been a governor. It is very clear that the governor abdicated. And in fact, on the record, the governor said she had delegated her role to County Secretary, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, number three, it goes to the point, where is the 1.5 Meru people, Mr. Speaker? It cannot be that you don't agree with the MCS, you don't agree with the church, you don't agree with Jurin Jeke, you don't agree with elected leaders, 10 or 11 of them, Mr. Speaker. It is not that all others are wrong, Mr. Speaker, until you disfranchise, humiliate, vilify, bully elected leaders in front of the president. Mr. Speaker, the deputy president and the president on several occasions have tried to reconcile what is it hard for governor to work with the rest. Because they, whenever a problem comes, they only come up with a gender guard. And I tell you, there they is a saying that is popular that what a man can do, a woman can do more. What has happened, there were insults from the men. But did you see, Mr. Speaker, on record on WhatsApp, the governor herself said to the deputy governor, you will defecate of a cardo seeds, Mr. Speaker. So which insults is better than the other, Mr. Speaker? We cannot hide, Mr. Speaker. We must lift the veil. For Meru to move forward, we must stand with the MCS and give them the confidence to ensure oversight, Mr. Speaker. I can assure you, Mr. Speaker, if today Governor Gawira Mwangaza, Mr. Speaker, is shown the door, Meru will heal and will go for the better going into the future. Mr. Speaker, I submit. Senator Osotsi. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, because of the short time, I want to start by saying that uh, 